hello and welcome back to the blender barbox channel today we are going to see how we can tidy up the model that you see on the screen if you are interested in the process of generating such models importing such models from google maps you can go back and watch my previous tutorial on this and also there is another bl blender tutorial that i did on how you can import such models from google earth so this model is made up of multiple individual faces that are not joined and there are some duplicate faces also there could be some intersecting meshes so to clean up everything what you can do is go to the scripting tab click on it and then here you have uh, the option to create new so click on new then go to the maps 3d mesh cleanup repository i will put the link in the description section there is a code developed for uh, this purpose this code was developed by uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it, uh, it's Vupli Lars. So this is the author of the code. So what you need to do is just copy this and paste it in Blender and run it. So the code is just available. And here you can click on this button to copy the contents and go back to Blender and then just paste it now the whole code is pasted in the in this section as you can see the only thing you can do now is just to run the code before that if you want to see the progress you can go to windows toggle system console and this window appears this will track the when while the code is running so now the code is imported just click on this button to run it or alt p is a shortcut form so click on it now the code has start running to trace the the progress you can look at this screen now the code is running so it says here cleanup started the first process was joining it joined the multiple separate objects it removed doubles it removed vertices it removed duplicates uh, materials and now it's creating a new material it's also doing the uv unwrapping and now it's baking the texture so this will take some time so i'll stop the recording now and i'll be back when the code uh, runs when the code finishes running so the code has finished running so uh, in general it took about seven minutes for me so this may depend on your computer speed as well as the size of the model that you imported from the google maps okay let's go back to the layout page and see how it's how it's appearing now the first thing you may notice that the model is now a single object all the different multiple pieces have been joined together into a single model the other thing yeah, and the mesh seems to be better right now than it was before. It was more simplified. You can see the mesh by going into the edit mode. And here you can see now the mesh is more clean. looks like a clean topology for me yeah so 
kudos to the author who wrote the code otherwise if you did this manually it will take you forever Yeah, so that's one thing. So the final thing is to save the textures that are baked. For that, you can go to the shading mode. And before that, you want to check the material. Here you can see in the material section, the new material is collection material. It's named collection material and it has been saved. So we can go to the shading parts and select the collection texture. Here we can see all the textures. So this need to be saved. For that, you can go to file, external data and pack resources. All right, this way you can save it. So that's all uh, for today. I hope uh, you find this useful. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe the channel. I'll see you next time with another Blender tutorial. Thank you for watching. Take care.